Hello and welcome. My name is Monica. Are you creating a policy manual? And do you need a little help? Well, let me share with you how I completed this task. Your policy manual is simply the policies and procedures of your company or organization. Essentially, this is your plan. You describe what you want to do. What would you like to change? Or how can you improve a task? This is what you will compile in your policy manual. Your manual can be a written document or paperless electronic file. With myself, I created an eco-friendly policy manual in PDF format for our company's holiday donation drive. I provided a step-by-step -step process of how to recycle unused toiletries by donating items to emergency shelters. Policy Manual Structure The cover page will be the title of your manual. Table of Contents will be the quick reference guide of steps and page numbers. Summary of the plan will be your explanation of the main topic. Benefits and effects are the details that tell how this plan will help and who this plan is affecting. If your policy manual includes related costs, include the figures. The date of the manual will show how current the document is. Don't forget to include the credits or visuals or information you use. Now that you know the structure of a policy manual, here are the procedures to have in mind. Your policy manual procedures will be a step-by-step -step direction for your reader. Save time! No need to call or email others for answers. Your procedures will have the answers. Improve the knowledge of your reader. Your procedures will be providing a standard plan of action. Think of your policy manual procedures as a map for everyone so that no one will be lost. Your actual manual can be a hard copy printed out and neatly organized in a binder. To be eco-conscious, you can eliminate the paper trail and waste by creating an electronic version saved on a network or device. It can also be an online version, which can be added to your website. Now that you have an idea of what a policy manual is, let's get started on how to create your policy manual. In creating your policy manual, let's use the PSA as your guide. PSA is the problem-solving approach you will use to get your policy manual completed. This is a five-step process that will keep you on track. Plan, research, draft, review, distribute. That's it. You probably realize that this is the process you have used and didn't know that it had a name. That is what I learned. As long as I was aware of the five steps, I knew what direction I was headed. Step one, plan. Brainstorm your plan. What is your objective? What helps me is putting a plan into steps. What is first? What naturally comes next? Step two, Research. Find out the facts of your plan. What do you already know? Think of the questions a reader will have and provide the answers. In my research, I contacted the emergency shelters we were donating to and asked them, what do you service and what do you need? So put the facts in a list, number them or bullet them. Be clear and concise. Step 3. Review. 
Conduct your own usability test. Check if you meet the needs of readers. Offer the policy manual to another person for them to review. Get feedback. See if it makes sense to them. Check if they have any questions. Include the suggestions into the policy manual. Now you have fully engaged your reader into the process. Rewrite and combine your plan and the reader's suggestions into a document. Step 4 Draft You are now ready to write or type out your first draft. You have done the research and you have followed the PSA process this far. Great! When you develop your first draft, think of some visuals you can include now or later. Now you can really get creative. Step 5. Distribute. The fifth step of the PSA process. You are ready to click send in an email or print out for distribution. Congratulations! You have completed your policy manual with the PSA as your guide. Now people can use the policy manual. You can update it from time to time, polish it up, and keep it fresh for your readers. I think we got a lot done. You had a plan and wanted to put it into action. You used the PSA as a guide. Now your plan is a policy manual. I hope this presentation was helpful. I know the PSA helped me complete my project and enabled me to effectively communicate my plan. You are welcome to take a look at my policy manual, available on voicethread.com at the link below. Thank you for listening. <laughs>